हेलो एवरी वन माय नेम इज क्रांति जोशी असिस्टंट प्रोफेसर टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट दी वेरी मच नोन टॉपिक दैट इज अ गूगल फॉर्म वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट दी एंड इंट्रोडक्शन टू गूगल फॉर्म मोस्ट ऑफ द यू हैव ऑपरेट दिस गूगल फॉर्म इन द कोरोना पीरियड बट स्टील मोस्ट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स आर नॉट अवेयर अबाउट दैट हाउ टू क्रिएट अ गूगल फॉर्म so let's first talk about what is a google form google form is an easy way to create survey forms questionnaires and quiz select from multiple question types drag and drop to reorder questions and customize values as easy as posting a list form allows you watch responses appear in a time and then gather result in a spreadsheet and analyze data right in google sheets so students basically google forms gives you facility that you can collect data from multiple audience in less time and google form gives you facility uh, that you no, don't need to sort out that data in manual way you will get data into sorted format that is uh, in form of spreadsheet or in form of uh, graphic uh, graphs so next we'll see how to create a google form okay for creating the google form there are the two ways first of all you have to go into your google drive for that go into your google drive in your google drive you will get option new click on the google form and select the first option blank form after selecting this option you will get this untitled form this option only available for the computer you cannot uh, use this option by using the mobile phone for mobile phone you have to go into the google type create a new google form and after that selecting first option you will get this first uh, uh, you will get this blank untitled form then next after creating the google form you have to change the title of the form so that audience will get to know about that which data uh, contents from that google form so uh, gives the title to the form by selecting this left option untitled form then next uh, gives the main title to the page here google workshop survey uh, is there so here you can click and you can gives the uh, title for the page then next you can change the setting of the google form means uh, theme you can set the theme for the google form let's see the practical select this option i can select the color of my choice c color of form getting changed okay so this is how you can uh, customize form according to your choice then next uh, you can add the question into the google form for adding the question here the uh, here is the option untitled question add your question suppose i am adding question what is your age okay so this is my question after adding the question google form uh, gives me option uh, that i can uh, accept the answer of this question in multiple formats so they uh, there are the multiple options are available i can accept this answer from the, uh by using the short answer paragraph multiple choice check box drop down so many options are provided by the google form so i will select the appropriate answer uh, type so uh, i am going to select the multiple choice so c after selecting the type of answer uh, i am going to give the option so first option will be the 20 to 30 years then uh, for adding the next option i will simply click on the add option so i will uh, type next option 30 to 40 years okay so uh, this is the format for adding the uh, answer uh, for adding the options then you have the options that you can the uh, you can add the image into the option so for that you have to click on this uh, image icon 
select this browse button by using this uh, facility you can add the image into the option okay then next we'll see that you can add the new uh, question just by clicking the this plus arrow once you have clicked the plus arrow you will get the option for adding the new question so here i am going to add a new question what is your name okay so this is my next question so i i am going to select the uh, answer type for the question that is a short answer okay this is my next question so google form next gives you facility that you can shuffle the question abhi mujhe ye question ki position change karne so simply i can select this question and drag this question to the first question so see uh, before that age question was first question and name question was second question but now the name question is going to be first and age question is going to be second so this is how i can change the place of the questions next i have uh, this is a choice of answer i can accept from the user so i can select the type uh, for the accepting the answers then uh, this is a facility this is a feature that is a required means i want that uh, yeah, user has to be uh, attempt that question means uh, that question should not be going to be blank so at that time i will select this required field so without uh, giving answer for this question uh, user cannot submit this google form okay then next to change form setting the setting icon will allow you to customize your form even further see there is a setting option uh, by using this setting option you will get more uh, options means you want that only one recipient can fill that google form so you will uh, set that option go into the responses and select that limit to one response means by using one email id one user can gives the uh, response at a one time okay then next see restricted means you can uh, se select the setting you want to restricted for certain people so this facility also provided by the google form then next you can make you can conduct quiz by using the google form so uh, here you have to go into setting and select the option make these quiz so after selecting this option you have to go into the questions you have to set the right uh, right answer from the options so here are the two options uh, in uh, from these two options i have to select which one is right so that google form will automatically assess that uh, assess the answer from which he will get from the users so simply i have to click on the answer key after clicking on the answer key i have to select the right answer and set the point for that question okay so i am going to select two points for the particular questions first option is right option so here i am going to uh, select it done okay so right answer get set for this question then next you can add the feedback for the particular questions means student will able to know that which one is a correct option which one is incorrect option okay then you can uh, see you store there is a facility that student will uh, get to know about the instant uh, about the result means uh, when once they have uh, con they have filled the google form they have con uh, they have filled the uh, quiz form then after that immediately they get to know about their result this facility also provided by google form that student will get about their result instantly get about their result okay so here is a facility that view your score uh, once you have click on this button then student will uh, see the score of their quiz okay then after collecting the uh, responses from the various students you will see uh, you will see the result into the responses form see here i am going to show the uh, one example for how to see the responses uh, from the users 
so here is my questionnaire you i have collected various uh, responses from the students so uh, you have to go into the responses you will see how many user have given responses so here 45 users are there who had given responses see i have seen the each uh, i have seen the separated data sorted out data graphical format data okay uh, now i want to see this data into the excel format so at that time i will just go into this option and download response so after downloading that response this data gets converted into the excel format see means google automatically means google form is very helpful which helps to helps you to collect the data and automatically converted that data into the sorted format so it is a very easiest way to conduct the survey conduct the test 